Welcome to the demonstration system Communication with Simatic S7. This module outlines the basic communication mechanisms of Simatic S7 and introduces you to their application with Step 7. We start with configuring the I.O. communication. Due to the data exchange with actuators and sensors, it is closest to the process. In this case, we use an S7300 CPU as Profibus DP Master. Three DP slaves will be assigned to it, an I.O. module, a drive module, and a connection to the ASI bus. The S7300 station with the Profibus DP Master has already been configured to the extent that a DP Master system can be inserted as a basis for I.O. communication. Subsequently, we select the desired DP slave from the hardware catalog and connect it to the master system. The automatically displayed address dialog offers addresses for selection, which are still available in the respective Profibus network. Even for complex slaves, such as drives or a network transition, the allocation to Profibus net and DP master occurs in the same way. When compiling the project, NetPro checks whether all necessary details are given. In our example, a component in the Simo Drive Slave Drive module, which we insert in the Step 7 Tool Hardware config, is still missing. Here, the hardware catalog offers us all components permitted for insertion into the slave. The configuration of the ASI net can also be completed in hardware config where we insert the required ASI slaves into the configuration table of the DP ASI link. For components not listed in the hardware catalog or only listed in an older version, module information may be available some other way. Hardware updates of SIMATIC products or GSD files of external products can simply be included here. In order to complete the configuration, we update the database of station and buses for the entire project by means of save and compile.